Watching Gotham Galleria. I'm V. I'm from Charleston, South Carolina. I study here in Parsons. I'm a fashion student. Some of my fashion inspirations is obviously Vivian Westwood, Wadditch, yeah. Muslin, Knit, mm -hmm. Susie Sue, Ooh. and Pete Burns. Also, this set of jacket that I studied myself. Okay. I got into the style probably a few years ago. I became very interested in it because of Vivian Westwood. Mm -hmm. um, and also I really love punk music, post-punk music and goth music. Okay. So it just all falls into place. Before this, I was definitely dressing in more J fashion, Japanese fashion, Harajuku fashion, which I think does kind of intersect with Vivian Westwood and all the other fashion influences I mentioned because of how popular they were in Japan, especially in Harajuku. I got this uh, from eBay for like 10 bucks. Now you say you started it yourself? Let uh -huh. me see. Ooh, so much detail. And the skulls here, you did it yourself as well? Yep. And lighter caps. The bear bag, where's that from? Um, I got this at a different flea market, actually down south, and all the pins are just stuff I've collected over the years. Cool. I got this from Etsy. It's just a loose knit. Uh, mm -hmm mohair. A t-shirt that I cropped and cut up myself. It has a screen print of Susie Sue. And these two, are they one piece? Um, like this they're separate, okay. yeah. These are Coco Rods and I just ladder laced them. And okay. I think it adds just like a nice pop of color in any outfit, especially oh. if I'm wearing an all black outfit. Thank you look you. at some of your piercings, where'd you get some of this stuff from? Um, I got most of, if not all of my facial piercings here in New York. Okay. and. I did my ear piercings myself. Can I see? Oh, wow, you did all those? Yeah. This is just a industrial, just huge ball chain. I've had this for years. Buying vintage, more sustainable, and I tend to find that vintage clothes is constructed a lot uh, better than newer fashion. It's time to rate the fit. How would you rate your own fit? 10. Well, I'll let you go. Can I get you to share your Instagram? Mm -hmm. Uh, my Instagram is AI Organism. Hi, I'm Achint and I'm from New Jersey. I'm just hanging out with my friends at the Chelsea Flea Market. We're just looking around. Okay, just thrifting? Yeah, pretty much. Anything in particular you're looking for? Not really. I'm really into silver jewelry recently, like as Ooh, you can tell. Look at your stash so right now. I'm just looking for silver stuff. Okay. Nothing like too crazy. Yeah. Why do you prefer silver over gold? I just think it looks better on my skin tone. Uh I've never really like played around with gold jewelry too much, but I really like how silver looks on me personally. Fashion and style inspiration comes from people I see on the street. I'm also like, I love Kanye West's fashion advice. I know he's quite controversial <laughs> right now. As well as Shia LaBeouf. I think he's a really good dresser. I'm like always in awe whenever you get like, he gets papped. I think it's like, wow. How would you describe your own style? Uh, I think you said it like perfectly, like avant-garde, uh, kind of unique, like not everyone's going to be wearing what I'm wearing. <laughs> I actually got these at the dollar store, no way. so uh, yeah, there's like no branding on them at all. I got this at a thrift store in New Jersey called Bo's Attic. Did you get a good deal? Yeah, it was 10 bucks. I think. Oh, it's quite well. So it's fire. Yeah. The shirt. Um, I got this actually when I went to Rolling Loud in 2019, which Ooh. is kind of cool. How'd you get it to look all faded like that? Um, I just like put in the wash like <laughs> over and over again. <laughs> Parachute pants. I thrifted these. The kicks. These are Balenciagas. Ooh. I think when you buy vintage, there's always like a story to the piece. You never know where it's from, and I always think it's like who could have worn this. For example, this leather jacket before me and like what stories it has and memories it's had. And I also think like shopping vintage is like much more ethical for the environment. Using what we already have and it has stories that we can add more stories to is like kind of really cool. On a scale of one to 10, it's yeah. time to rate the fit. I would give myself like a solid 7.5 out of 10. I feel like it's quite really comfortable. I think that's like a big thing I look for in an outfit is like comfort over anything. Well, let's go. Let me get yeah. you to share your Instagram. Uh, It's just a chinth Kugelon. Please follow me all right I'll thank you all right <laughs> my name's Mia and I'm from Dallas Texas 
Big D in the house. All right. What are you doing? Always. What are you doing all the way in New York? Um, well, we go to school like an hour or two up north, and we're just in the city for the day. We love to come shop and like eat. What are you studying? Um, I'm a fashion merchandising major. Now we're about to go thrifting. We're about to go to Second Street. We were just at a thrift store down there. Yeah. I love like 90s hip hop, street style. My mom's from Brooklyn. She grew up there in the 90s, so she's like a big inspiration for me. You're totally pulling off the 90s. <laughs> Thank love, you. Right? I appreciate Let's break it. down the outfit. Where's the jacket from? This is actually thrifted. This is hers. Is over it a here. Harley? It is a Harley. Let me see. Awesome. Harley patches on there. This is Aritzia. This is from Amazon and then I put it on a necklace. Yeah. These are actually vintage wrestler. They were my mom's from the 90s. Uh, we have Doc Martens on. You got a couple oh. inches on those. Oh yeah, yeah. platform always. <laughs> Your bag? Proud of moment. That's a vintage one, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I love buying vintage because when people ask me, like, for example, all of my jeans are vintage. So every time I'm wearing them, they're like, where are they from? And I'm like, oh, they're vintage jeans. Like, you can't get them anymore. <laughs> and also, it's just as a fashion major, so much more sustainable. It's time to rate the fit. Mm -hmm. Scale of 1 to 10. How would you rate your own outfit? I don't know. I might say 9. I kind of like my outfit. I just love when I wear super baggy jeans. I love my layering right here and how the colors go together. Before I let you go, can I get you to share your Instagram? Yes, it's Miet Christine. I am Sophie and I'm from Annapolis, Maryland. I go to school at Marist uh, for fashion design. So I love street style. Recently, trends that I've been eating up are ballet trend um, with like leg warmers and ribbons. I also like Western fashion, cowboy boots, bolo ties, stuff like that. You're mixing all like the down south with the New York style. I love it. So this is actually my roommate's. The bag is... Guess? Guess. This is my friend's. He gave it to me. It's it's so 90s, right? Cute. Thrifted pants worn inside out. And I first. love the way how these are so distressed. Yeah. And Where are these from? The cowboy boots are also thrifted. They're falling apart, but I, I absolutely love, love them. them. Yeah. And I know you mentioned a bolo tie, and I love that it oh, looks like yeah. a bolo tie. Yeah, yeah, I made right? my own. I made my own. <laughs> right. I love the way you use silver jewelry to set Thank your you. outfit off. Yes, yes, so yes. So let's talk about the hoops first. Okay, so I got these off the streets here in New York. I added a Jesus pendant on the second hoop. I actually got these um, from Dior off eBay. In your opinion, what are the advantages of buying vintage versus buying new? I love buying vintage clothes because I think it gives them a lot more character. I love balling on a budget. Now it's time to rate the fit on a scale of 1 to 10. How would you rate your own outfit? An 8.5. And before I let you go, can I get you to share your Instagram? Uh, my Instagram is Sophie Valerio. I'm Julia. I'm from like 20 minutes north of Boston and Mass. Uh, we're just poking around the city, going to some thrift stores, flea markets. And then we're getting dinner later. Uh, I love the 90s. I love like the gothic kind of era. Um, GJ Hadid, love her. Uh, Rachel Green, this is from Princess Polly. And then I have this top. It has some lace at the top and bottom. Very like asymmetrical. Some cargos that are from Brandy, but I got them on Depop secondhand. Just some Doc Martens. Super cute though, I love it. And then your bag? Uh, I thrifted it. What are the advantages of buying vintage versus new in your opinion? It's more sustainable and you could find pieces that like are very individualized. So if someone asks you where you got it, you could say, oh, I thrifted it so they can't get it. <laughs> so it's time to rate the fit on a scale of one to 10. How would you rate your own outfit? I would rate it like an eight. Before I let you go, can I get you to share your Instagram? Yes, it's juliabrown.. I'm Lauren and I'm from Columbus. The fit. You have like a 60s groovy look, right? I love yeah. it. What are some of your fashion inspirations? Okay, well, I'm, it doesn't seem like it for my fit, but I'm really into like 2014 grunge style. This is my mom's. I, I took it when I went home and Let I brought it back. Let me see the back of it. Oh, it fits you so well, yeah? yeah. All right, and the cute little bag. Yeah, just, I, just like a regular bag. Right. This is from Aritzia. These are, um, I got these like a couple years ago I from a vintage these. shop. I think they're vintage JC yeah, Penny they're, actually. They're real, they're real vintage from the 70s, yeah. I'm assuming, right? And then the kicks? And then I thrifted these, they're vintage. Ooh, they they're got a little really platform up, going too, right? Steve um, this is from an estate sale, and then these are Chan Lil. You see? Oh, they work so well together. What is the advantages of buying something vintage versus buying something new? Well, I feel like vintage is just really cool because I like to say that everything that's already cool, like that already is cool, has been made already. Um, so I just like coming here and finding new stuff and I really like vintage stuff because I think it's made better and is more unique. So I just like buying from there better. Is this something particularly you're looking for today? 
now. Just want to spend money. <laughs> <laughs> Time to rate the fish. On a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate your own album? I don't like a ten. I don't know. Before I let you go, can I get you to share your Instagram? Um, sure. It's Lauren Dot Oh.